What is up everyone? Hi me Phoenix, how are you getting on? Welcome back to Kindergarten! As you can hear, I have a little bit of a sore throat, so I won't be as good with all the voices today as usual, but I'll try my best. We're gonna do another mission today. And I think, let's see what we have here, exactly. Yeah, I kinda wanna try to get to this mission, which I believe is Nugget's mission. So I think I need to do the Hitman's bodyguard for that one. Start the mission by talking to Felix and then Ted. Okay. Uh, I have heard that I need a battery for this one. So let me go and buy that from Monty. Still selling stuff? Yep, it's going to be a struggle, but I fully intend to keep my business running. I'll buy something. A uh, battery. Two dollars, sure. I also learned that you start every day with $5 automatically, you can't earn money or lose money, as with the previous game. Alright, pleasure doing business with you. It always is. <laughs> um, let's talk to uh, this dude. I told you already, Teddy, the plan is foolproof. Just do exactly what I told you and... I know, it's just... I don't know, Felix, this whole thing seems so wrong. Ozzy hasn't done anything to us. Talking about Ozzy? Hmm? It'll be fine. Quit being such a... Uh -huh. How long have you been listening to our little chat? Whoops. He found out, even though I was right in his face this whole time. <laughs> Good. I wouldn't want Ted here to get in trouble. Hey, why would I get in trouble? I didn't do anything. Which is just so typical for you, Teddy. Huh. I'll just save our family's company myself. Good luck with that. Now talk to him. Oh hey, I'm Ted. Why aren't you in on Felix's plan? Because he's good for nothing. Disgrace to my family's name. I'm sorry Felix, I just want to help. I can do this. Maybe I can explain better during morning time. I'll be in the regular class. The stupid class. <laughs> huh, the stupid class. If you want to talk then. Okay, see you then. Okay, cool. I can't wait to get started. Now, now that I think about it, we can start now. Uh, what do we need to do? Well, we're going to need to, dis to distract Ozzy during morning time. Talk to him and see if you can figure out what will draw his attention. Okay. And I'm gonna need someone who I can stage a fight with. Probably a girl. Although with the re reasoning, I'm not sure if there are only any um, in the dumb class. I know a dumb girl. I do. <laughs> Teddy, you can't pull this off. I'll handle it. Let it go. I'm gonna try. You'll see. So, I think only Cindy is actually in our class, so we might need to talk to her. This school is so much more my style, especially the new selection of boys. What do you think? Uh, Teddy wants your help with something. Oh, how forward! I've only been here for like 5 seconds and I'm already being propositioned. Yeah, whoa, amazing! Great, good for you. Well then, us easels have to go through a little test. Here's some gum. If he makes... It find its way into another girl's hair, then it's a date. Why is it always the gum in someone's hair? Last time it was Lily, now it's just a random girl, it doesn't matter. Okay, I'll let him know. I don't like it when a man keeps me waiting. I want it done before the bell rings. Chop chop. We'll get right on it. So, is there a girl you can set me up with? Yup. Ew, why did you give me some chewed up gum? Stick it in a girl's hair. What? That's so mean. But my plan. Will this girl go along with my plan if I do this? I think so. Okay, I guess I'll just stick this in Carla's hair. Why not Penny? No! Uh, I mean, Carla is mean sometimes. See, there's gun in her hair more than Penny. Ah, okay. I get it. He has a crush on her. Probably. Or he's scared of her. That's also possible. I don't know. Either one. They're kind of similar. <laughs> <sighs> I'm really sorry about this, Carla. Sorry about what? You haven't done anything. Psst, it just puts the gum in your hair. Oh, so that's how it's gonna be? Well, you just made yourself an enemy, Ted. I'd watch your back if I was you. I'm really sorry, but I have this really elaborate plan to... Get away from me! Jeez, okay. Aw, oh, man, she seemed really mad. I feel terrible. This is your plan. 
I know, but can you just go over there and see if she's okay? Maybe we can make it up to her later. I'll see what I can do. Oh, that was wonderful. You're gonna be an excellent boyfriend. Yeah, okay, it's all coming together. I'll see you in the morning time. Good grief, Teddy. It's fine, Felix. My plan will work. You'll see. Okay. And there goes Monty. Talk to her and see what happens. Ugh, what the heck is wrong with Ted? He just came up and stuck gum in my hair. Uh, anything I can do to help? That's nice, kid. I appreciate it. I could use some scissors to cut this crud out of my hair. Where can I get those? Upstairs, since you're in the less gifted class, you, it could probably be easier for you to get them at lunch. Okay. Thanks, kid. Here's a vending machine coupon. I would do it myself, but I'm not allowed to use the machine anymore after I started counterfeiting these. Okay. Got a fake pass. Fake coupon. Nice. That's the bell. Everyone head inside to your assigned classrooms. Okay. Here we go. We're making it. Okay, kids. Teacher has a headache, so we're going to be very quiet. Looks like the school is more funny than the last one, since they're actually toys. Go play. Please be quiet. Whatever, whatever. Alright, should we just talk to Ted? Or F Felix? No, wait, Ted? This is Ted. Yeah, this is Ted. Oh good, you're here. Felix has this scheme that's gonna help our family's company. But I have a better one and no one wants to listen to it. What is it? I'll tell you, but you gotta promise not to tell anyone though. Felix will be so mad if his plan gets ruined and it's all my fault. I won't tell anyone. I want you to kill Ozzy. Why, Ozzy? Well, you see, um, Felix said it's because... I actually don't know, but I think it has something to do with our inheritance. And you just want me to kill him like that? Okay. How do I kill him? Well, I want to give him an asthma attack. He uses his inhaler a lot. He keeps it in his cubby. Why do we need Cindy? We're gonna need a long distraction. I figured we could pretend to fight or something to draw the teacher's attention. And you could grab it. Okay, let's do it. Right, but first we should handle Ozzy. You should get something to distract him, right? Yep, that's what I got the battery for. Good thinking. He'll move to the other side of the class to play with Destructron. Destructron? Okay. Go give him that battery and then we can talk to Cindy. And there's Nugget. <laughs> oh, Nugget is present. Now, Nugget is late, so you're gonna get study hall. Oh dear god, what happened to your arm? Nugget had to shoo it off in order to escape from the felt Nugget cave. Oh. Why did you... Never mind. Do you want to go to the nurse? You're bleeding all over my new classroom. Nugget is quite durable. Nugget will survive. If you insist, go ahead and play or whatever it is that you do. Okay, is that a... Is that a fidget spinner? Okay, well, that was like two years ago. But not anymore. <laughs> Apparently still in this game though. Anyway. The Structon was the best toy in my toy box. My fans and I used to play with him all the time before the new kids came in. Was the best toy? Yeah, but now he's out of battery. No friends, no toys. The new kids are the worst. You can have this battery. Whoa, really? Thanks, maybe you aren't so bad. Yeah, maybe. Or maybe I am. <laughs> I'm gonna go play over by the toy box. I'll see you around, kid. See ya. Okay, so I distracted him. Now what? With Ozzy out of the way, we're ready to make our move. When we start the distraction, be ready to grab that inhaler. Let's do this. Also, Felix didn't get a chance to empty his copy before going to smart class. There's stuff in there that might be worth grabbing. Like money? No, 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 no. The money's in my cubby. Felix is to the right of Ozzy's. Okay. Anyway, let's get started. the distraction, lead the way. Okay, should we talk to Cindy then? I just love this doll, she's so pretty, just like me. We need you to cause a distraction. Oh really? Sorry sweetie, but I only do something like that for my boyfriend. Ted will be your boyfriend. Yeah, remember? We need to put on a show to distract the teacher. Hehe, <laughs> oh yeah, that's my kind of date. Are you ready to go then? He is. She likes abuse and role-playing quite a lot. <laughs> Yeah, let's go. Be ready to grab the inhaler, kid. Oh, I'm ready for it. I sure am. Follow me, boyfriend. We're about to have our first spat. Okay. Are you ready, sweetie? Ready for what? You haven't told me anything. Just play along. I've done this a million times. 
Play along with what? This doesn't... How dare you? Ow, she just punched him. Hey, that hurts. You're a jerk. Well, there's more where that came from. Hey, Cindy, stop. Knock it off right now. Oh, there goes teacher. <laughs> oh, and she goes to fight Cindy. Of course. I need this. Uh, I need the inhaler. I also need this. Felix Cubby. I actually don't know what's in it. Whatever, the screen and a bag. Is it weed? It might be weed. <laughs> okay, okay, I'll stop, but I'll kill him if he ever does that again. Not enough, you little brat. You're getting study hall for this little incident. It was worth it. <laughs> okay, cool. Did you get it? Please tell me you got it. <laughs> Imagine if I said, no, I didn't get it. I was just doing other stuff. <laughs> I got it. Awesome, you're really good at this. Thanks, now what? Now that we took away his lifeline, we just need to stress him out enough to trigger an asthma attack. What stresses him out? Ozzy is a bit particular. He likes to do things a certain way. If he can break his routines, he should start freaking out. Okay, where do we start? Lunch. He does a lot of really specific things there. It shouldn't be hard to throw him off his game. Okay then. Attention new kids. Here's your passbook. If you get an adult to sign it, you're allowed in the halls. Don't get any crazy ideas, so you're only allowed to use it once per day. Oh, so I get it now. I just get it. Oh, thank God. That's the bell. Get out of my classroom and go to lunch. Alright. Let's do lunch. Oh, there you are. It's time to move forward with the next stage of the plan. What is it? Oh, there's Felix. What the devil are you two are you talking to him for? What are you two doing? Oh, uh, nothing, Felix. I'm just going to show the new kid where the forks are. Follow me, new kid. Okay. Okay, Felix can't know that we're doing this. I want to do it just the two of us so he knows that I can take charge of stuff. Okay. In a few minutes, Ozzy is going to leave and use the bathroom. You need to take the stall on the left. That's the stall he likes. Okay. Um, first off, how do you know that he's gonna leave for the bathroom? That makes no sense. Second of all, why that stall? <laughs> so what? It'll stress him out. That's the name of the game here. We just have to keep putting pressure on him until he cracks. Now go to that stall and wait for him. Okay, jeez. Oh, Felix is watching. Here's a fork so we don't look suspicious. Thanks. Also, did you talk to Carla? Will she forgive me? She wants scissors. Of course. Well, you should probably do that while you're out as well. Good idea. Alright. You cannot leave. You have not eaten yet. Oh, I need to get a burger. Because I'm a good boy. There we go. I hope we have enough money for this. But we'll see. Uh, I bought a burger. Uh, please allow me to mark your passbook. There you go. Thank you for buying lunch today. Okay, so... Hey man, you need to... A pass to be out here. Go back to lunch or I'm giving you study hall. I have one. Oh, a bathroom pass. Okay, go ahead. Thanks. Okay, so use the left stall. I think I messed it up by doing it too early. Shit. Can I just go upstairs then? Back it up, kid. You're best for the bathroom, not upstairs. What can I do so you'll let me up? Hmm. Well, that little narc took my cigarettes this morning. You wouldn't happen to have something to smoke, would you? I do. It is weed. I knew it was weed. Whoa, this is even better than cigarettes. Thanks, man. You're welcome. Okay, so... I need to get scissors? Use coupon on scissors. Don't buy anything. No, wait. Now I think I'd first need to go to the bathroom, since the guy, Ozzy, is coming any second. Right? I hope so. Yes! What the? Who's in there? This is my stall, I use it every day. Come out right now. I'm not done yet. Unacceptable, everyone knows this is my stall. Now hurry up and finish. Just use the other one. The other one? I'd better die. Then die. Ugh. You haven't heard the last of this kid. Bye, Ozzy. <laughs> Alright then. That worked. Now I need to go upstairs, I think. S take the scissors, use the coupon. Yes. Thanks for the hookup and everything, but you do gotta get going, bro. Sure. Got everything. 
Have you seen my inhaler? I thought I left it in my cubby, but it's not there. I haven't seen it. Darn it. Good thing I keep a backup in my locker upstairs. I'll use that if anything happens. Shit. Okay. Did you hear that? He has another inhaler. Darn it. Well, he definitely seems stressed. I, th uh, I take it you made it to this stall on time? Yep. Good. We continue with the plan then. We just need to adapt a little. How so? We've got some things to do. One is to find a green flower. Ozzy is highly allergic. Just seeing one should be enough to freak him out. Okay. There's a few around the school. I know one grows back by the dumpster. We got that last time. Okay. Gate. It will open with a slight push. Open the gate. Why does it use an apple? That's not fair. Flower. Take the flower. There we go. Now what? Did you get the flower? Yep. Whoa, you are good. So now we just have to get into that locker and steal the backup inhaler. How do we do that? There's only one person that could get us into that locker, and I put gum in her hair this morning. Well, I have the scissors. Well, let's see if we can smooth things over with her. Maybe she'll forgive me. I hope so. Alright, let's talk to her. Get in line, gringo. It's still my turn to jump on the trampoline. We have a job for you. Is that so? Well then. And why would I be so inclined to help kids with gum in my hair this morning? I'm really sorry about that, but if it helps, my plan has been pretty success- Shut it, snob! Did you get the scissors I asked for? Yup. Good! At least I got that going for me. So you will help us? Ah, uh, I guess. If you do one more favor for me. Which is? You see that kid in the wheelchair over there? He's been making some moves on my turf today. Gotta show him not to do that. How? Here's a screwdriver. See to it his wheels are less than operable. We can do that. No way, you'll see us. There's two of you. One of you pretend to buy something from the little fence while the other sneaks behind him and pops out a screw. It's not that complicated. Good, come see me when it's done. Okay. Uh, I guess we have to do this. We have to further disable a cripple. I feel sick. You are trying to kill another kid. That's different. I know Felix has a good reason for... Never mind. Let's just get it over with. Right, before we do, if you want to buy or sell stuff, you should probably do it now. Adopt he be in the mood after we ruin his day. Good idea. Can he sell something? This inhaler. I can sell him the inhaler. Two dollars? Sure. I might need money later. Um, okay, let's, let's do this, Felix. Or Ted. Right, before we do, uh, yeah, what do you mean? For the last part of my plan, you have to go to science instead of gym. I'm ready now. Okay, I'll go pretend to buy or sell something. Just try to make sure he doesn't get hurt too bad, okay? Do my best. Oh, don't I need money to get into the science class? That's probably it. Hold on a minute, kids. Money back's over here is gonna make a purchase. Okay. Here we go. Should I remove a screw from Monty's wheelchair? Yes. Jeez, poor dude. Oh, ah, no, 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 no. What happened to my chair? That sucks. Why is this happening to me? Oh my, I, uh, I'll let you get yourself together. We'll talk later when you're, um, not on the floor. Just get out of here. Aw. Well done. Okay, a deal's a deal. I'll see to it that Ozzy's locker is open by the time you get to it. Can you grab the inhaler for us? That's not part of our deal. Only s You only set the locker. You're gonna have to grab whatever you want by itself. Okay. I feel pretty bad about that, but it was necessary. Sure it was. It's almost time to do the actual job now. Are you ready for your big moment? Okay. When the bell rings, pay the lab fee and go to science. That's where Ozzy goes after recess. Once you're there, cause a distraction and sneak out. Grab the inhaler out of his locker. Once you have it, show Ozzy the flower. You should fall apart and die. Sounds like a plan. Ugh. Sore throat. <laughs> Jeez. It's not nice. It sucks. Whatever. I'll keep going. I'll shut up. Felix and I will meet you after school. If all goes well, you'll be handsomely rewarded. See you then. Finally, just one more class and then I get to go home. <coughs> Jeez, that voice though. Anyone wants to play the lab for you go to science classroom, everyone else meet in the gym. 
go to science. I like me some science. Welcome to science class. Today's lesson will be about plants. Please observe the common plant in front of you. Notice how it's neither carnivores or poisonous. Because the PTA is a bunch of cowards. <laughs> Feel free to, add, to take a sample and look at it under one of the microscopes. This one won't do much, but it could if Aussie's mom wasn't such a wimp. What? Uh, I can't believe we don't get to show and tell. Hey, what's that? What? That pretty flower you have. Can I have it? Only if you help me. Help you? I guess I could do that. What do you need? I need a distraction. I don't know. Dr. Dennis seems smarter than Miss Applegate. He probably won't fall for any old distraction. You're gonna need something big. Like what? Gosh, boys are stupid. Just look at this place. I'm sure there's something you can use. Maybe by the computers or something. See what I can do? By the computers? This is an electric outlet. It can probably be used to create a distraction under the right circumstances. I should tell Cindy. Because I need the distraction. What is this? Could change the lesson plan if I got to this book sooner. Oh. Great. Well, Cindy, I got something. Well, what's your big distraction idea? Gonna use the electrical outlet. The electric outlet? How is that gonna create a distraction? Stick this in it. What's that going to do? Make a distraction. If you insist, but I want the flower before I do anything. I could get in trouble, but it'll be worth something... For something pretty. What? I need the flower, though. Shit. Box of slides? I could put samples on them and view them in the microscope. Okay. Uh, microscope. Um, is there anything else that I could do? Shit. Because I can't really gift a flower. Oh, I see you like the leg. I used to have two, but the other went missing. If you find it, please bring it. Okay. Fish in the tank, small yellow particles. I wonder what they would like, like magnified. Alright, I'm just gonna give the flower to her and see what happens. Oh, goody. Get ready to run. Here comes a distraction. Oh, God. Okay, quickly. You're gonna zap yourself. <laughs> hey, Dr. Danner, look what I'm doing. What? Wait, what are you doing? That's not a good idea. And Cindy died. That's what I thought. Your new children are dumber than the monkeys whose brains I removed. Okay, nobody move. I'm sure the power will be back on soon. Bye. Need to get to his locker. Uh, yes. Take the inhaler. Should I take the flower back from Cindy? Take the flower. Sorry, Cindy. Oh, there we go. Everyone get back to doing science. And we're just gonna leave Cindy right there. Dead on the floor. Jeez. We're killing a lot of people just... To get to Ozzy. <laughs> Go away, kid. I'm trying to learn about plants. Check out this plant. Ah, no. Get that away from me. I think huh, I'm having an asthma. Oh, jeez. Give him some room. Damn it, Ozzy. We've been over this. Where's your inhaler? If I... Locker, please. Hurry. Okay. Well, Ozzy, I have some bad news. It's not there. So it looks like you're going to die here, but don't worry, it won't be in vain. If you sign on the dotted line here, I'm semi-legally allowed to use your body for science. Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> okay. I'll just forge it for him. It's what we would have wanted. It's totally what he would have wanted. Good news, everyone. I've suddenly come into possession of a cadaver. Tomorrow's lesson will be anatomy. I just noticed the body count of today's class has been slightly higher than average. Perhaps we could end the day a little early. Everyone go home. Cool. That's it. Did we do it? I think we might have done it. Here we go. There's he is, Felix. I told you he would do it. I... I didn't see... Ozzy come out of school. Did you really do what my brother is suggesting? Yep. Fascinating. Well done, then. This is exactly what I wanted. Yes, exactly. I knew we could do it. And we did it all without your help. Yes, I'm sure Father will be quite proud. Give him his reward. Give him the thing. Oh, yes. Um, here you are. 
What is it? It's a pin from our company. It represents that you are a trustworthy ally to our family. Cool. Say, Teddy, would you mind telling the driver I'll be a minute? I just need a moment to talk to our new friend here. Sure thing, Felix. Before I go back, take this monster on card. It, look, it looks kind of like Ozzy did before. Uh, bye. <laughs> nice. Oh dear, what a mess. A mess. This wasn't supposed to happen. Ozzy wasn't supposed to die. You didn't want Ozzy dead? Goodness no, I want it set dead. Why? Perhaps we could discuss the matter tomorrow? Perhaps. Excellent, good day to you, Hitman. Good day. <laughs> so he wants me to, to kill Ted as well. Okay, but we did it, prestigious pin. New clothing, spoiled pink dress. Germaphobes stripes, cool. And a monster one card. Yes! That was so nice! I'm so happy we did it! We got another item and everything. We got monster one card, we got an outfit. Let's check out these outfits. I can become Cindy. Or Ozzy. Ah yes, let's wear Cindy's dress. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Whatever, I'm just gonna do it. We're gonna go with it. Can I see if I can do another mission now? Yes! If you can dodge your nugget, start the mission by talking to another and give the tool belt to Bob. Cool! Okay, so I need both items for it, I think. I like this new map, it's pretty handy. But, for now, I'm going to be leaving this episode here. That was a fun episode. We did another mission. Next time, I'm gonna try my best to do another mission. Anyway, this was you, Phoenix. I hope you enjoyed. Subscribe now for more to come. Until then, be brave, be kind. And stay awesome.